Easy. Let's go. Let's jump into 11 table tennis. Playing with the G spin to enhance the gameplay and feel and also the realism. Okay. I couldn't get, couldn't get anything. Got in there. It's more enjoyable to play in VR when it feels like you're uh, actually holding a ping pong handle. What's up, man? What's up? How you doing? Good, good. First time on in like, fuck, I don't know, eight months. Got drunk, played some real ping pong the other night. I was like, I gotta pick up the Oculus again. What about using like a paddle? Do you ever use one of those accessories? No, I, I, you know what? I wanted one. When I was playing back then, I really wanted one. I should buy one. Check out the G Spin. It's a new one. Yeah. You sound like you're in uh, Mississauga, Brampton, Toronto area. Ah! God damn, I'm, got, I'm not more, even uh, from there. I can live there for two years and I can tell exactly where they're from. Really? From I'm, I'm more like um, a little bit a little bit north, yeah. a little north of Toronto. Right here, yeah. <laughs> where are you from? New York. Your accent's not too thick. Maybe it's because of the mic. Hey, hey, Tony! Hey! <laughs> 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 the pepperoni, eh? <laughs> damn it. Ooh, little spike you set me up there. My favorite is going for the spike and then soft. Ooh, I like that. I'm gonna try that. Okay. Oh. Go away, it's like fucking Hurt me. It's one of those. Because <laughs> the person goes back. Your leg. And then it drops. How about you can't go too far back? No. Actually, I guess you could kind of like. In theory, if you have a massive space, you could like. Start really smacking it, like all the way from here. How far back can you go? Ooh. Oh, I won! Wait, I hit the what? table. No. <laughs> I guess I guess it clipped it. <laughs> I did it not clipped see it. That shit. <laughs> That's crazy. Good game, man. Good game. Good game. All right, I'm, I think I'm done. All Too right, hot. Yeah, I feel that. I'm. <laughs> sweating, dude. Well, I'm one and zero. You know. <laughs> you on one win streak. Appreciate you, bro. Okay, a few things you gotta know. Make sure you set up the paddle properly. You're gonna go into the game settings here. You're gonna go to position and paddle. Uh, they always update this game, so in the future this may be outdated, but the, the theory will be the same. Uh, new position. So it even tells you here to squeeze the grip of the paddle, um, and then you can release when it is in the right position. So let's go ahead and, sorry, squeeze the grip of the controller. Okay, so once you squeeze the grip, your paddle freezes, right? So you wanna position the uh, controller basically where the paddle is in real life. So you could kind of feel it out and adjust it as you need to where it, the controller is gonna feel realistic in your hand. Oh, there it looks good. Man, I'm telling you this, especially for the backhand, when you're hitting that backhand, it just allows you to really like fully feel like you're playing. I've seen other handles out there that have like a real plastic grip, like, and it's this is actual wood, so it, my hand doesn't sweat and slip on it, which is really nice. And you got the real rubber here, so it, it feels like I'm playing real ping pong. Okay, you just got your G-Spin and you wanna figure out how to install it. It's really simple, let me show you how to do it. Uh, the G-Spin works with both your right and left hand controller, which is great. Uh, when you're installing it, you want to make sure to uh, undo the Velcro to make it easier. The G-Spin nylon back to Velcro. Uh, you're going to take the, in this case we're using the right controller, it's going to hook right into the sensor ring at the top here. Um, and then there's a little nub here that actually sits in, the, in between the crevice of the controller. So you're going to make sure it butts up against the controller. You don't want it to be hanging out there like that. You can rotate it and make sure it's sitting right in that crevice so it's nice and secure. And the controller, you can see here, it kind of follows the contour of the, of the G-Spin. So once it's in there, you're going to wrap the Velcro around and into the, uh, or through the steel ring go ahead and pull nice and tight and then you're going to secure the uh, nylon strap and you're good to go and now you could jump to the game and enjoy your g-spin